On this episode of Game Shack, it's more weirdness from Arcade 1UP as party cades disappear from the shelves and all of their products are gone off of QVC's website. Also, big pricing increases on those party cades if you can find them. Let's talk about it coming up next. Hey everybody, welcome on back into the Game Shack. I am your host, JDV for Evil Genius Entertainment. If you haven't already subscribed to the channel, please do so, and if you do, hit the notification bell so you get new video announcements like this one. And as always, you guys are our sponsors, so if you can give us a thumbs up on the way out the door, or buy me a coffee, links down below, I sure would appreciate it. Okay, that little bit of business out of the way, I was looking around at the usual suspects to see if I could find any sales for Arcade 1UP products, or at games for that matter, and I went over to QVC, as I am wont to do. Uh, QVC is actually where I have bought uh, all three of the party cades that I've owned, because they usually have them at a decent price. You can get three to five, uh, you know, payment plan through them. Usually it's free delivery. So it's usually a pretty good deal if you can uh, kind of wait around and wait for those kind of deals over at QVC. And so I was very surprised when I went there this week and saw that they had nothing available at all. When you put in Arcade 1UP search results come up zero. And I typed it in again just to make sure I had not typed it wrong. I put a space in between there, nothing. Whatever I did, I could not find any Arcade 1UP products. And that was a big surprise to me because they used to have pages and pages of Arcade 1UP products. And like I said, it's one of the primary places where I would look to first when I wanted to add a party cade to my lineup. So I have no idea whether or not that's because QVC decided to drop Arcade 1UP and just get all their products off their website or if it was something that Arcade One decided to do. Should be known that you can go over to uh, HSN's website, Home Shopping Network, which I believe is owned by the parent company that owns QVC, and there you can find Arcade One Up products, again, for much more than you would uh, normally want to pay, um, but it is there, so that's kind of weird. And I looked around at, at some of the other uh, sites like Kohl's and Walmart, and I could not find anything that was, well, there's a couple of things maybe on sale at Walmart, but nothing that you'd want to shake a stick at. And again, there's no sales on Kohl's. And that led me to another interesting discovery as I was looking at all those websites, and that's the fact that you really cannot find those party cades anymore, hardly at all. There's really only two varieties that I can see as of right now, just a little past mid-March, uh, that you can buy, and that would be the Miss Pac-Man or the Super Pac-Man party cade. We're not seeing the Defender cab that everybody really wanted. I had that cab for a long time, and it's a very nice little party cade. In fact, probably the one you'd want most of any of them. They had a nice single-player Street Fighter uh, game that you could get on there. Uh, I believe they had a Glax, and they've had a, a few different varieties of these party cabs, and you simply can't find them. When you can, it is either Miss Pac-Man or the Super Mac Pac-Man cab, and they are now on every single website I checked. Uh, Kohl's, uh, HSN, Walmart, all of them are going for $2.99 right now on all of those websites. Now, as you can see here, the same cab went for $99 the last time it was in stock. So you're talking about a massive 300% increase in the MSRP for this cab. So to see all of them essentially off the shelves except for the remaining stock in Super Pac-Man and Miss Pac-Man, presumably cabs that they made a ton of, got me wondering whether or not Arcade 1UP ever intends to issue out these cabs again. Or if they do, they're sort of getting us ready for the new um, starting point for those cabs, which is gonna be apparently $2.99. Again, that is a massive price increase. Previously, those party cades were easily the best deal going from uh, Arcade 1UP unless you had some kind of cutthroat sale at Black Friday. Other than that, the normal pricing of those cabs was easily the best that you could get and was a great way for people to jump into this hobby. That now seems to be gone both because you can't find the cabs anymore other than those two varieties I already mentioned and Again, it's going for 300% more than the original MSRP from just a year ago. For my part, I hope that they have not made these party cades extinct. The way that you could play on them, giving you all kinds, you could play them on the table, you can hang them on the wall, you could build your own little cabinet for them that gave you a lot of flexibility. You could take them to other people's houses, although they did weigh 20, 25 pounds, so not super light and portable, but you could do it. 
and it was a way that somebody who didn't have a lot of money or a lot of space could get into the hobby. So I really do hope that Arcade 1UP has not killed off the Partycade, and I really do hope that that $2.99 price tag, uh, you know, comes down to $1.99, which I think is a fair price for that. Okay, so that's going to wrap it up for me. Uh, let me know what you guys think. Are you concerned about this at all? Is this something that interests you in the slightest? Or is this just another potential stumble from Arcade 1UP? Please let me know what you think down below. All right, uh, love each other. And until next time, I'll see you guys in the Game Shack. Mwah! Be sure to visit EvilGeniusEntertainment.com for exclusive content, swag, casting call news, and much, much more.